Are you a business owner that's been personally victimized by the influencer hype syndrome? So what is that? The influencer hype syndrome, what I like to call it, is the after effect of when you've had a grand opening, for example, and you've invited some content creators, maybe some influencers to come to your space, to try out your products, create some content about your services, or maybe a special offer. And you notice that at the beginning, it's all great, you get a lot of traction, but then they move on to the next and the hype dies down. So as an influencer myself and having worked with big brands such as Vessi, HelloFresh, Disney, there are a couple of things that I've learned through influencer marketing that will help you as a business owner. So the first things first, as an influencer and a marketer, you must have a very large audience. So how do you get a large audience? Well, it's through reciprocity. Whatever you put out, you will get back. So I always tell business owners that you need to start with doing commenting, likes, doing following in order to get it back. So that is my number one tip. The second thing is being a good content creator. So if you're somebody who loves to edit, who loves to plan, who loves to film, you will be successful in this realm. And that's what makes content creators so great at what they are is because they spent time doing that. So as a business owner, you would have to do that as well. And the third thing is to build a brand. So as a business owner, you have to ask yourself three questions. What product or service are you offering? Who are you offering it to? And how are you going to do that? Once you've answered this, you're on your way to success, my friend. But if you're a business owner who doesn't have time, or maybe you just rather outsource that, contact me at Take Back Technologies. My company will be able to help you get to that level of building a brand, not just a business. So make sure to message us and we can get on a discovery call today.